a little cloudy here in California today, which is unusual. But I love it. I love this type of weather. So I decided to do the video outside. Um, I know we have some things to catch up on. We have some things to catch up on. Um, thank you for being here with me today. If you haven't already, subscribe because we are going to be on a journey. When I tell you a journey, we are definitely going to be on a journey. And I would love for you to be on it with me. I would love to have somebody to talk to. Basically, that's really it. I just need to get this stuff off my chest. Um, so, I'm going to jump right into it. I like jumping right into it. So, right off the back, we're going to pick up where we left off. Uh, we left off at the HSG. Um, right now, I'm going to show a clip of the HSG video. Um, on this journey, I'm going to try to, as much as possible, show you guys' clips, take you guys with me. Um, you know as much as possible as much as they allow me to but the hsg i kind of as you guys are gonna see i kind of snuck and videoed it so i don't mind you guys seeing that um or hearing what the doctor said um so i'm gonna let you guys have a clip of that and that's how we're gonna start off um yeah, so we'll let it run. Um, we're gonna talk about the doctor appointment. I went to my follow up doctor's appointment. In the follow up doctor appointment, um, my doctor, who I love, Dr. Maruzi, you know, um, tells me that. You know, the best way to go about conceiving is IVF. Yeah, I just had to fall. Because being totally against that, I want to just naturally, oh my God, I'm pregnant. Well, girl, that's it. Okay. She tells me that. And she tells me the price. Okay. Over $10,000. And, uh, you know, you can travel to other states and get it $10,000. But it's like $20,000. Yes. I said it. $20,000. Over $20,000. $25,000. It just depends on how much stuff you end up buying procedures and treatments you end up doing during your IVF cycle. I just had to pause. Um, she says that I have a 5% chance, I think. Yeah. I'll go with the lower one. I want to say she said 10, but I think that's just made up in my mind. I think she told me I have a 5% chance of conceiving on my own. Um, or anybody that knows, that's out of 100, obviously. Um, I have a higher risk of a tubal pregnancy because this is bothering me. You see? It's bothering me. Um, I have a, right, a higher risk of a tubal pregnancy. Um, if I got pregnant, naturally. Because what would happen would be that I would ovulate, the egg would go into 
the water flow benches and the sperm would be going in the water flow benches. And if we all don't know, that's where the egg and the sperm meets in the flow benches. And they have to travel back down to the uterus, okay? That's the two or three day journey back down to the uterus, okay? Um, they can't get there because they're stuck in fluid water. Then they're just gonna implant on the wall. They're gonna implant in the wall and that's attempt to grow there so that's what makes the highest I know I don't sound like I'm just like bummed about it and it is really much a lot to go through um, talking about the idea of everything is a lot those are my dogs of course because they can't let me shine <laughs> the only little munchkin kids I got But it's really beautiful out here. I like the clouds. Yeah, I'm deterring because the subject is really, it's just really so basically all of my TTC and tracking my ovulation and everything was for no reason um, but it was for a reason I take that back I take that back you know what it was for it was for knowledge and that's the biggest reason of any that's the best reason of any I know my body now um, and I'm gonna show you guys how to know your body you know what I'm gonna make a video and I'm gonna show you guys how to know your body I'm gonna name it know your body because we all should know our bodies and I definitely definitely know my body um, we're gonna explore the IVF route I don't want to you know I don't know how we're gonna afford it kids right so don't have a choice if we want kids now I mean of course we can keep trying for another 10 years and the possibility is like 5% so I mean I guess you could think that possibly eventually I probably would that's a lot of unsurety but Let's say that I do, then it's a topic, meaning pregnant in the tubes. So, she did give me an invasive um, surgeon number that does um, like really serious surgeries. So, I probably will call him. So I could, you know, try everything. Um, I, you know, I am gonna, since my HSG, I have been, I'm not going to, I have been taking a lot of stuff to try to clear my tubes and stuff like that. But it's like, am I gonna continue trying to clear my tubes for like ever and then wait to get pregnant and I'm already just you know I just have them 
Thursday, Friday, seven, but Thursday, seven, nonetheless. We're gonna, we're gonna, you know, I'm, I'm gonna research the IVF thing and I'm going to talk to the invasive surgeon. I'm going to, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but I'm going to research it. Like, I don't even know. You know, so. I guess you would say they're happy little dogs. <laughs> they are happy little dogs. But um, I'm going to cut some roses today. My rose bushes are definitely ready to be cut. Um, I'll probably trim some stuff in the garden and go to work. But I did want to tell you guys the update on what's happening. It's very, 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 very messed up. Like you do everything. You do everything, you know. And this is like, wow. Well, I'm supposed to get this money to have a baby. For, where am I going to get this money to have a baby from? How, like, IVF? That's like a whole, that's a whole thing. I knew about my tooth, so I kind of knew it was going to be a journey, but I didn't think that was going to be like an only option. It's not an only option, obviously, you know, God works in mysterious ways, and I always believe, that's why we are the believers, and I always believe that things, you know, happen, everybody's like, everybody's different, um, for a reason. And align with the universe, you know, so you know, God already has kind of things laid out, but I did say that, but I didn't think that that would be like uh, if I want a child right now before I turn 40 something, you know. If I want one child right now, then I better like do IVF. I never really thought that was gonna be a thing. Um, yeah, here we are. Good morning. 
here we are. And that's the update. That's the update. I'm prob that's not probably. I'm going to do a video on the things I did to watch my ovulation and watch like, everything to know when I ovulated, to know absolutely everything about my body. I'm going to do a video about that. So, any girls out there, because I completely did not know anything without the videos I watched from you guys out there in the world. So, I definitely want to add my video to the pile of videos to know some stuff. Um, after that, let's see, what else do I give you guys an update on? We will be talking about the research I found for the IVF. So my doctor did give me a number of a doctor with me. IVF doctor. So I'm gonna have a call around to different places. I'm gonna do research, call around to different places. That's what the next video will be about. What places I called. I'm sorry, I will call the doctor, my doctor me to also uh, tell me to call my insurance and then find out what it covers for infertility we're not going to use the word infertility here I'm just going to let you guys know that too the word infertility does not belong here because we believe I just won't have it. I won't take it. I won't accept it. I just won't. So. Oh my God. Delete. So. That's what I'm going to do next. I'm going to be updating you guys on that. Um, stay with me. I have my three subscribers. <laughs> Thank you for subscribing. I, I appreciate it because it's just, it's just us on this. I, I don't even want to call it a crazy journey. It's just a. It's my journey. It's my journey. Yeah. So I'm going to let you guys know next time. Places I call the updates. And stuff like that. And, um, yeah. We're gonna just move forward. We're just gonna move forward. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna start calling the places. And see on what place and start trying to figure out how to get the money and how much it costs and everything like that. And that's what we're gonna do. That's what that's gonna happen. Yeah, obviously, tubes. You know, so. Let me do some research. Thank you guys for hanging in there. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe because this is crazy. It's not crazy. It's not crazy, but it's a fertility journey. A fertility journey it's a life journey you know because of course if you hang with me i'm gonna put you guys in on some stuff that's going down in my life um but i definitely want you know you guys along the road to conceive because it does seem like and i was like two brothers it does seem like this is definitely gonna be a lot so 
It, is, it doesn't even seem it is. So we are definitely going to do this though. But I would like you guys here all the way to the end. You know, so stay down with me. I'll stay down with you. We're going to believe. We're going to believe that it's going to happen. That we are strong. We are capable. We are mothers. And maybe that's to anybody out there. Okay? Have a great, great day.